Hello, welcome to the Maya Tool Belt. This is Michael. Today I wanted to go over a very basic command for, especially for beginners. Uh, this command is under the Edit Mesh menu and it's called Delete Edge slash Vertex. And you can see the shortcut there is Control Delete. Now the reason why I wanted to go over this command specifically was because, especially when you're first starting out with Maya, you're first learning, it's very common to hit the delete key to remove things. For example, if I were to create a polygon uh, cube and I'm messing with it and I decide, you know what, I don't want this cube anymore, I'm going to hit the delete key on the keyboard and it removes it, right? Pretty self-explanatory. Let's create a sphere instead, polygon sphere, and scale it up. I'll hide the grid. You know, let's say you want to delete some edges on a sphere. Let me double click this edge and you'll see I select the entire edge loop. So I have that entire loop of edges selected. Now right now if I just hit the delete key, you can see it does delete those edges. However, if I right click and choose vertex as my component mode, you see that there are all these little vertices remaining where those edges were intersecting through this area. All those little vertices remain. And if you are not expecting that, it can be very uh, difficult to understand why your mesh is not working out the way you thought it would if you don't get or don't if it doesn't click with you that when I deleted those edges those vertices are still there and so then you have to go back and select all these vertices and then hit delete again and now that stuff's all gone for good so it's a little bit cumbersome at first to get used to but there is a command for deleting edges and also deleting those vertices that are along those edges which is what I just showed you. If I right click and choose edge again and double click this edge loop and I want to delete that edge loop just like I did before instead of hitting the delete key I can go to edit mesh delete edge slash vertex or hit control delete so I'll use the shortcut so hold down control hit delete and it removes that edge loop and the vertices that are going along with it okay so very simple command really there's no options to it of edit mesh uh, delete edge vertex there's no option box to control how that works if you select here poly delete edge one this is the history item related to that uh, edge deletion command you see there is a option here for clean vertices and by default it's on if i turn this off you'll see here that now those vertices are back so there is the option if you want to leave the vertices by and use this command at the same time so I use this command to delete those edges and I turn clean vertices off then it remain those vertices will remain on the sphere turn it back on which is the default value and those vertices are also deleted so essentially that's all there is really to it I just wanted to uh, have a video just explaining that fact if you are wanting to remove edges from your geometry don't just hit delete you want to hit control delete which is the shortcut for edit mesh delete edge slash vertex if you if you are new to Maya I hope this was helpful in hopefully explaining why you might have those little hanging vertices you know suspended in your geometry all over the place which you know I've seen happen time and time again especially with uh, someone new to Maya such as the students I uh, teach at school and other people I've seen you know who ask me questions online and such this is a really simple uh, new, very easy command to not know about <laughs> okay so yeah if you want to delete an edge loop or any edge really and you also want to delete the vertices that are along that edge then you need to use this command here delete edge slash vertex under the edit mesh menu hope you enjoyed that video and learned a little something something uh, thank you again for watching and hope you continue to watch and like and subscribe. Please feel free to leave your comments on any video and I do my best to read and answer any questions. So thanks again and I'll talk to you later.